Finally a TV advantage. Hello everybody, game number 15 is this? 14? Game number 14. I can do maths. A TV advantage, finally. 30, because he's got three journeymen too! <laughs> but still a TV advantage nonetheless. <laughs> he's 7-1-1. And he's got a claw, a roger. Wrestle horns. Lodge step. <laughs> oh man. I think this is the first time this team's had the TV advantage. Feels like it anyway. Yeah, very happy it's not Mighty Blow Claw. <laughs> I had the strangest experience. I had an outrageous froggy accent that nobody could understand and <laughs> sounded awful. Thank God I can say C not properly again. <laughs> Glorious. Thanks, Frosty. <laughs> oh, it's great to have her back, isn't it? <laughs> like it is, it's weird. It's weird, but it, it, it's actually good to have her back. That's so bizarre. All right, let's go with this. Right. Mighty blow either side. Three guard, three guard. Yeah, this is the way, isn't it? Right, let's save that. <laughs> TV plus match video, yeah. That, and it'd be interesting to see what they do if they reuse Dord Math and TV plus matching and stuff, won't it? It'll all be interesting to see what they do. See what they do and how they do it. It's so it's so weird not having French lady, but it's it's good to have the old the old bird back. <laughs> the good old bird. <laughs> He's only got three gutters. I've got a feeling he's only got three gutters. One. Oh, I could put all skills on. One, two, three gutters, yeah. That's good, isn't it? Only three gutters to worry about. This lineman. <laughs> oh, it's just random lineman. Oh, nearly. Oh, 
he's 710, so he's presumably fully competent. He is rats. That's true. <laughs> Oops. Hey. On retrouvera peut-être ce joueur plus tard s'il se réveille. <laughs> should I be very, very afraid? Oh crap, I should. <laughs> <laughs> to them, isn't it? <laughs> I assume he means he recognises me. <laughs> oh, the Rogers tail is absolutely hypnotic, yep. Oh, that's nice. That's nice, we get Mighty Blow Blitz him. Hit his pal. Oh, come on, this fucking rookie. This rookie, this rookie line off. <laughs> Kaz somebody and would have KO'd him, but for Thick Skull the second turn. That was the thing, I thought he's got to bring this guy in to get the 3D, right? Which means he might get, we might get the Blitz a uh, gutter. And this is into 2D, whatever happens. Very nice. Very nice. <laughs> yeah, that lineman. <laughs> it's scary, it's true. <laughs> right. I think getting him, it doesn't really matter, in here. Yeah. Ça cherche clairement le corps à corps. God damn it. Il n'a aucune envie de le laisser tranquille. 3D though with Mighty Blow on tackle, I like that. Got him. Oh, 
Man, got a Kaz and the Claw. Glorious. <laughs> Skill finally for him. He was in the starting roster as well, wasn't he? No, he wasn't. This was the one that got bought. That's good, isn't it? He? He's leveled. Finney's a tuddy away from Mighty Blow. He's a tuddy away. Or a Kaz. <laughs> yeah, that's good, isn't it? So while that that Kaz was sad, um, now he's yeah he's, he's got, he lost loads of players that turn. Oh, he gets the one day pal against Le Stand Firm too. Jim Shard. I think it is a bit yeah, Hatuj. I think it is a bit. I think it's not as broken as it was, but I think it's still a bit of a thing. This is this more threatening player though, this bloody lineman. Oh no, it's not this one, it's the other one, because this one hasn't got anything. Which was the lineman that got the cans? This one. This is the scary lineman. He's just not blitzing with him. <laughs> That gives him a two into a two. Now he's going to blitz him. <laughs> Rogue is dangerous now, isn't it, without block? Uh, let's stand firm, yeah. <laughs> Get up there. Two plus, no reroll. Come on. Come on, game. Let's see a good punish. That's true, yeah, Muppet, yeah, that's true. But then uh, that would have lost anyway, right? Ooh. The ball is rather exposed, isn't it? The ball is rather exposed. I think I just blitz with him. Because I'm getting him in further hits. Or is there something that I'm not thinking about? One, two, three, four, five. Do it with him, that's better. So he could block him. GFI to hit. And then push him into there, who then 2Ds in with tackle. Right. Should have done these first, shouldn't I? That was poor play. Bowed him straight up. Bowed him straight up. Oh, <laughs> God scatter as well. <laughs> oh, dear. He's an 
not that good of a god scout there because I can't hit him. And can't hit him. He's got to punch him. I've got a dodgy way, haven't I? No. Phew. <laughs> wow. -y. What a look at dog. What a look at dog I've been <laughs> this game. Juggernaut as well, so he could have surfed me. Oh, because he did the he did the he did the blitz because he's got Juggernaut. <laughs> oh man! <laughs> oh, disgusting! Absolutely disgusting! Love it. <laughs> Got to punch him, haven't we? Seeing as don't actually have stand firm, and then that gets an extra block as well, which is nice. Oh God! <laughs> what an absolute Dyson! God, Dysons are great, aren't they? When you get them. Get the GFI in. Oh God, he's not already dead. Now he's dead. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> he could do. He could do, because he's been turned over in his offence. He's used his apple. This could be a tactical concede, to be honest. Because he's just going to take a lot more blocks, isn't he? And he's very unlikely to win. Very unlikely to not lose. So, probably should be a tactical concede. No, it's true, it's true, Sadist Lab, but it's there's a bit of fun to it, isn't there? Like, yeah, okay, it is, it is a bit lame. I know what you're saying. I know what you're saying, it is a bit lame, obviously. But, on the other hand, it's still great, isn't it, just murdering somebody? <laughs> like, not in real life. <laughs> in the game. <laughs> in the game of Blood Bowl. Um... It can be quite fun to murder somebody. Right. 
Yeah, you do deserve the win. You roll better dice. If you roll better dice, you deserve to win. That's Blood Bowl. Blood Bowl 101. 3D here on this cutter. Didn't even kill him. What the hell, game? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> what an absolute joke. <laughs> <laughs> what an absolute joke. Why didn't how is he not dead? This is a disgrace, I tell you. Yeah, it's pretty brutal. Yorp. I wouldn't blame him conceding here. Yeah, I'd probably concede here if I was him. Eh, but on the other hand, he's only got five, so maybe he doesn't want to. We don't know how many times he's going to play. On the other hand, like the a juggernaut rogue is hardly worth keeping, is it? A blodge step. A gutter isn't worth saving. A claw tackle isn't so good. So really, all he's got going for him is the horns wrestler, which is pretty decent, to be fair. He's probably not going to win anyway, so... Hmm. Maybe he should. Maybe he should concede. I don't know. Right, he's going to there. Three, four, five. So let's make it seven. Cette formation permet d'avancer sans trop de risque. Ça va être dur de leur arracher le ballon. Ces joueurs qui se prennent. Ah, si ça continue, le syndicat va être. GFI. Yeah. GFI with the ball, classic Jim. I've even got a sheet that tells me to not do this. But I'm going to do it anyway. Because it's sterile and I like the taste. There you go. It's not legal to concede because he's got two reserves. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, might as well wait to see the cut the thing. Yeah, that's a good shot. Yep. Yep. It is that is the horrible thing. I he can do this. I probably should have moved him there to make the dodges harder, I guess. Might as well re-roll this, he's got two. It could work. <laughs> Phew. Right. So we want him forward. Oh, I should have put him one back in case then he could have caught it as well. Conceding looks a much better option now, doesn't it? Just don't kill him. <laughs> I 
Maybe I shouldn't have gone for the handoff here. I should have done it a turn before. But I want to do that serve. Don't kill him, but then he blitters with him. See, this is why. This is why you shouldn't ever let up, right? He can kill this dwarf with this blitz. He could have totally killed that dwarf with that blitz. That's why you never, ever, ever let up. Ever. I can't make it. Three, can I? Please score. <laughs> They were all there in case there were scatters, so there could have been multiple scatters and then maybe someone in the end zone could have caught it. Oh, the rogue is back. He's got the danger. The danger man. He, he could do a pass, but also this guy. No, there's someone on 13, isn't there? Yeah. Does a loner waddle up to his guy and blitz him? He probably does, doesn't he? <laughs> Go on, rookie, rookie dwarf. Not rookie dwarf. What, what's he called? Loner dwarf. He's already made a cast as well. Yeah, Nektor made like four removals in like two turns. Something stupid like that. And then um, he was under pressure, exposed his balls, and then uh, lost even more players. <laughs> Very good ride of Yeah, I've diced him. I've diced him. It's uh it's not You know, maybe I played well, but Because um, like no there was the thing there was the thing that I did the way that I based the roger so that he would have to he, like I did encourage him to base with a with a sat blodge step gutter to make it a three dice with his roger. So I, I did encourage that, which then led to the two D on the on the gutter, which removed him. So like there was a there was an element of good play, 
but mostly it was uh, it was dice, obviously. Mostly an absolute dicing. <laughs> yeah, that's wrong, uh, Jehania. <laughs> they are absolutely dice. <laughs> If someone says there are no dice, they're wrong. He can get a 1D on the ball here. No, he can't. He's got guard as well. You can't hit a good player. <laughs> Eat the loner. I don't mind. Oh yeah, the fat gutter, yeah, yeah, yeah. They, we, we we will see them, but only from bad cultures. <laughs> they've been they've nerfed them. Uh, they've nerfed them heavily. Um, but bad players think this is a buff because bad players are bad. <laughs> Really bad GFK. <laughs> Not right, Janian. <laughs> hey! <laughs> randomly, randomly nerfed the hell out of them. Uh... Trying to play a little bit safe. Wasn't really safe, was it? One day, me. Got to follow the law. Brawl is what Black Hawks get, and it's pretty decent. Um, someone will copy paste it probably. <laughs> the funniest thing is, Jehini, they kept wild animal for bloody uh, they kept wild animal for what's it called uh, minotaurs. They just randomly changed it for rat ogres. They just randomly made rat ogres worse. The people for the new rules, in charge of the new rules, were under instructions to change things a bit. Which... Um, it's not necessarily bad, is it? Probably quite good changes from Blood Bowl. Well, from Blood Bowl 2, I think they're good changes for sure. Oh yeah, I pushed him. I pushed him into range of this, didn't I myself? That wasn't very smart. Luggy. <laughs> well, he's wrong there, in my opinion. <laughs> Oh, 
went too far then, didn't I? I like how I can take five people out of the fight and still have, like, <laughs> still be winning the fight. <laughs> Yes, Frosty. So because they get to use their action, people think that's good. Disregarding the idea that you've got to have a handler with him who then gets placed prone and maybe dies and loses their action for the turn and maybe for the rest of their all of their turns. But, you know, like the fact that you knock over your own players, that you have to keep next to them in case that or he loses them. So uh, it's just terrible. It's just, it's just literally terrible. I don't know. People people just seem to fixate on one aspect of it and think, oh, this part is quite all right. Pretty stupid, I think. Just my opinion. <laughs> the fact he's got the uphill with wrestle, it isn't even that bad, is it? Uphill with wrestle. Right, we can foul him now, though. So that's nice. Three D him. Done it wrong. I've done it wrong. I guess it doesn't matter. I don't need the back guy, do I? <laughs> yeah, flicky flack. <laughs> Essentially. No, oh, I didn't kill him. Right, now I, I really want rid of the gutters so I can do the handoffs. It's situationally better if you can afford the spare player and if you can have that spare player stood next to him at the start of his action and if you don't mind him getting, you know, knocked over or cast or whatever if he fails. Then it's situationally better. But, it's, you know, it's so narrow when it's better that it's just so much worse. Once a game it'll be better, basically. And 15 turns of the game, it will be worse. <laughs> Something like that. Right. He can go and base him. I like that. Here's the 13 SPP going. Didn't have the run up. Shit. Oh, Got away with it. Got away with no run up. Hey. 
I don't know, GFK, though, if you remove Blanket Tackle on Dwarves, then they just get absolutely ruined by Adge teams. So it's like... Yeah, I guess if you put Tackle on the Blitzers. I'd have been okay with that. Hey! Boo! Yeah, probably the Slayers as well, yeah. Hey! Brilliant stuff. <laughs> oh no, he can 1D! Oh no! Phew. <laughs> Fucking few. <laughs> I'd have been fuming. Alright. Get a mighty blow him, that's nice, isn't it? Not dead. Jim Shard. They don't get. No, they get more ruined if there's movement four man. I mean, they, they lose a fair amount of their time anyway against dodge teams. Even with tackle. If you take away the one thing they've got against dodge teams, that's pretty stupid, isn't it? I don't need to stall it out because. What does it matter? Make sure I get the tuddy on him. Well, he's, he's taken it well to say he's been completely, absolutely shafted by the dice. He's been a lovely chap, hasn't he? I guess he could one turn and then maybe get a blitz and, and draw. But realistically, I thought. <laughs> realistically, let's go for the... Uh, He's he's actually he's probably he's more worthy, isn't he? The blitzers aren't so good. I they kind of are. It's good having the mobility. Yeah, that was nuts. It was nuts. That basically killed the game that time. Because he, he double skull, didn't he? Double, double, bat, double bought down on the uh, claw blitz, which then got him hit back, got his gutter blitzed, got the other guy blocked, and it all went wrong from that turn. Yeah, with no edge and no move, dwarves without tackle just get absolutely caned by it, like elves and rats and stuff. Yeah, yeah, that'd be that'd be pretty decent. Yeah, if you if you had if you had troll slayers and blitzers with tackle, it wouldn't really make as much sense fluff wise as the long beards having tackle. But it would certainly make sense mechanically. Wouldn't it? Yeah, exactly. That's getting ridiculous, isn't it? And if you if you two tap block from them, then they'd be really weird. I don't think you'd have to start tackle. On them. I don't think they'd have to get tackle. I think tackle on the blitzers, because you would still just take tackle first skill on them. Then tackle a mighty blow first skill on the slayers. So that'd be fine. Make the long beards movement five. 
for losing tackle. That would help a lot. V10, yeah. With rock hard skin or whatever it's called. Space for him to score, first of all. Don't want him to have to uh, go to the trouble of blitzing somebody and maybe casting them. Tease me, bro! <laughs> Tactical using a two there. He's, he's still got a GFI hand off, hasn't he? Tactically using the thing. I'll say GG. Oh, he gets to level him as well. Be nice back! <laughs> Don't kill my... Don't kill my long beard! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but they're already outrageous with movement four and tackle, aren't they? <laughs> so... You know, who knows what you, how, what you could do with them. Why did I only get the chance to buy one of them? Oh, because the other two died. <laughs> the other two died. And scored that touchdown with him, and then he got the MVP anyway. Absolutely classic and standard. But that was a pretty good... That was a good turn, wasn't it? That one turn, basically, won it, with all those removals and then the pressure, which uh, got the ball in trouble. And in dwarf hands. Glorious. Like three levels from that match. Not bad at all. Let's take guard for a change. And... Oh, it wasn't him. Oh, no, they were both. I don't know. Mighty blow for a change. And... Oh, no, it wasn't him. It wasn't him. Okay, that's all right. Right, and then he won't stand firm. It was the other one who levelled. All right then. It, it was Coffee Monster who got the MVP. It was Finney who scored. So that was pretty good then. That was a, that was a fair enough MVP. It wasn't annoying. So Che Canstar still, you know, will get a skill if it's a close game. Um, otherwise, it's Dietrich wants to get two touchdowns. Um, or maybe just hand off to a, a rookie long beard. <laughs> Maybe now nah, I, I want to go with uh, three, three, three journeymen. To be honest, I don't want to get. A, uh, it depends if they get an MVP. Just wait for an MVP to buy a, a ninth player. But that's looking pretty good, isn't it? Three stand firm for one turns. Lovely. I like I like stand firm on the blitzers because I think mighty blow isn't so good because they haven't got tackle. So I like a bit of stand firm on them, and then uh, so three stand firm, three mighty blows. We can have five mighty blow eventually, so yeah, just score on, just get touchdowns on these two if we can to get uh, five mighty blows. Oh, glorious! Right, ten two two, lovely. 
Thanks for watching. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.